We're not far now. The Gwyn Whitehill may already be there. What is this? Our ironwood trees. It's the Whitehills. You see what they've done? This track was hundreds of years old. And they reduced it to nothing. I'd heard of this. But to see it with your own eyes, it takes your words from you. The White Hills need to answer for this. And Gwyn needs to answer for this. But we need to find out what she knows. She'll be over there. Be cautious, my lord. If she go around her father to help us, she must have some purpose. She's taken a risk in meeting me. Let me hear what she has to say before I judge her reasons. Of course. Just be wary. You see what her family's done here. Here. You might want this. You may have known each other since you were children. Doesn't hurt to be careful. Go on. I'll stay with the horses. Schaden kann ja nicht schaden, den Dolch mitzunehmen. Würde ich sagen. Wie er dahin humpelt. Die haben einfach mal alles abgerodet da. Die Schweine. Das kostbare Holz. Bisschen schneller hier. <lacht> humpel schneller, humpel Stielchen. Ich well. I remember hiding down there, playing monsters and maidens with little Naaman and, and uh, Megan. <laughs> Was spielt der Jung Monster und Jungfrau? <laughs> Schleifstein. Hmm. I can still smell the sawdust. <laughs> Hear the whining of the grindstone. Such a part of my early years. So long ago. So, und dann meine fette Axt. Das ist aus Holz, kann das sein? <lacht> Krass. I see you haven't lost your warrior's ways. That's good. I wouldn't want to deal with someone careless. Hello, Gwyn. Roderick. You saw my father's work over there, didn't you? There's no way to miss it. And he won't stop. He means to do that to every inch of your land. Soon there will be nothing left to save. I hope you come with help, Gwyn. And I hope you'll listen to me. I come as a friend. <sighs> I wasn't sure you were even going to show. We're taking a risk, meeting like this. Unfortunately, it's the way it has to be. Thank you for paying respects to my father and brother. For coming tonight. It's good to see you again. And you too, Roderick. I think we can help each other. But first, I. I've heard news of Asher. That he plans to return to Ironrath. Why is he coming back? I loved him once. I longed for Asher to come back. But not like this. If you've come here to say something, just say it. You can talk about my brother after. I want peace between our families. No more wars. No more bloodshed. Is that what you want to? I need to hear you say it, Roderick. Will you work with me to bring an end to this war? I want to know the price before I agree to pay it. I'm no fool. It seems that you are, because you clearly don't understand. Peace is the only hope your family has. My father is just waiting for an excuse to attack. Why do you think he sent my brother? So there will be trouble. My father will bring utter ruin on your house. Unless you let Griff feel like he's in control. I know you refuse to kiss my father's ring, but you would be wise to show more respect to Griff. I'll put on a good face and let him think whatever he likes, if that's what I have to do. It is. My lord. A band of riders approach from the north. Seven hills. 
My father's guards must be tracking me. If they catch us here, they'll kill you. I'll face them if I must. You should be smarter than that. Just listen. My father is planning to make a move against your family. I don't know all the details, but he's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. I fear for your family, Roderick. You may think you've nothing more to lose. He is ready to show you otherwise. What the hell is your father planning? I swear I don't know, but whatever it is, he knows all your weaknesses, all your plans. What? How? We have Verräter, Leute. Because you have a traitor in your council. Someone who knows every detail of your circumstances. My father boasts of it, and I've heard some of the reports. You must tell me, who is it? I don't know. We know you're planning to force Griff from your home. Even if it endangers Ryan's life. What? My father's guards are close. I need to know you'll do what I've asked. Promise me you'll submit to Griff. If you want peace between our families, it's the only way. You have my word, Gwyn. I'll do my part. Thank you. My lord, those riders are nearly upon us. We have to go. What I told you. Be careful what you do with it. And remember, I'll hear about it if you don't. Das ist vor allem die Frau, die wir eigentlich heiraten wollten. Die wir geliebt haben. Come along, Duncan. Wir haben Verräter unter uns. Ich wette mit euch, das ist der Wachmann. Das ist der Wachmann, hundertprozentig. Mother. Roderick. Look at what's become of our house. You were nowhere to be found and they just... Oh, they are vile men. Where were you? We need you here. To hold this house together. Mother, I... I went to see Gwyn Whitehill. You did what? You would meet with the girl who once tore this house apart. Oh, I, I see now why you went in secret. Surely you must have known I would have counseled against it. She wants to help us. She wants to bring about peace. And as much as you may mistrust her, we need help. I don't know how you can trust that. Well, what did she have to say? Lord Whitehill is plotting against us. I don't know his plans. But I fear them. And the only way he'll stop is if we submit to Griff's rule of our house. What? Would you really give up control of our house? Griff is already a torment. How much worse could it get? I have to keep the peace with Griff. Even if that means letting him have his way at times. The thought of it makes me ill. I don't like it either. Was this all? Did you learn anything more? You need to tell me. What I've told you is nothing compared to what else I've learned. There is a traitor in our house, on our council. No, this can't be. And all our plans to save Ryan, to save this house. All gone. Roderick, who could have turned on us? Times have been hard, but I never thought this would happen. Not in our house. I have to say, Royland worries me the most. Perhaps. But what about Duncan? Duncan? Or Maester Ortengren? If we don't know, then we can't trust anyone. Then again, I don't know why we should believe anything that girl told you. The White Hills would love to sow dissent in our house with lies of traitors. 
100 Pro ist es dieser Kommandant da. Stay cool, stay on the Get down, get off again. Get down there and die. What do you want from me? No, no, he was over there. And Ramsey was here. I'll play how I want. You will bend the knee to your liege lord. I must speak true. I haven't the balls to defy you, lord. What is this? What are you bastards doing? Oh, look here. It's the new lord. You're in luck. We're just getting to the best part. <laughs> Little Lord Ethan's final breath. Unless you want to play the Lord of House Forester instead. You can't do this. You can't do this. Get out of our house right now. <laughs> we'll do as we please. Besides, we're not finished. You... Must stop. Oh, I know you've seen it before, but um, it gets better every time. You want to play? Yeah, we want to Give play. me the knife. No, no, that won't do. If you won't be eaten, you'll just have to watch and see how it's done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please, no! Say hello <laughs> to your father. Oh. <lacht> alle Köpfen, alle Köpfen. Oh, well done, well Schön done. langsam. I'd say, I'd say, I'd say he died better than the real Ethan. <lacht> What about you, eh? You want to be next? Men without honor are lower than dogs. <lacht> I'd be happy to dirty my blade with your blood. Before this is over, your blood will join my brothers on that floor. So I hope this was all worth it. It'll be worth it when I pull this blade from your neck and see the life drain out your eyes. Come Make his basket. mother watch. No more now we'll really have some fun. Enough. Griff will deal with him. When he's done, he'll own this fucking house. And he'll have more than just words for you. Take your boy out of here while you still can. Roderick! Roderick! Now is not the time. Fusa. Was für eklige Assis, ey. Wendell, pack the extra rations. Duff, make sure the quivers are full and the torches are dry. Garrett. What's happening? We're heading north of the wall to deliver justice to brothers turned traitor. They're hiding in the woods, at a place called Craster's Keep. I've been looking for volunteers. The cowards murdered Commander Mormon. We're going to kill every one of them. How far north is this Craster's? Some 60 miles into wildland territory. It's treacherous country. I appreciate if you're thinking of going, but you should know Brit volunteered. He took his vows in the set. He's a brother now. I understand why you hate him. But bad blood could jeopardize this mission. Too many unknowns out there. I can't have my own men killing each other. I'm a ranger now. I've left my past behind me, Brit included. Until you're standing next to him with a sword in your hand. That's the real test. If you do come, I need to know there won't be any trouble, even if he provokes you. Can I count on you? I need your word, Garrett. I'll be taking a chance. I'm a man of my word. 
I won't disappoint you. I'll hold you to that. It's a hard road to Crestus. We leave tomorrow at first light. Now why don't you go talk to those two? They volunteered as well. Make sure they're ready. Dorf! Where are my arrows? Well, what did Jon Snow say? I don't think he likes us much. Definitely doesn't like you, Finn. Haven't heard him singing your praises, have you? Oh. He was just wondering how you two snot-nosed idiots have survived this long in the Night's Watch. Cotter's the one causing all the trouble. <laughs> You're the one giving me reasons to cause trouble. Point is, he doesn't want any problems with either of you on this Craster's mission. <laughs> well, there's something you should know, then. <laughs> I, uh, borrowed this from you. <laughs> what? I just got curious. I wanted to know why your uncle was here. It never ends with you. What didn't mean no harm, honest. I just wanted a quick look. I wasn't stealing. You can't keep doing that, Cotter. Next time, ask. Well, I did try. And you, you just said your uncle was here about Ironwood. But I think it was something else. I noticed this part here. North Grove. That's just some shit story for little kids. A rumour. No, it's not. Of course it is. I had it to Witch's Den where they turned children into giants. Garrett, you don't actually take it seriously, do you? It's a fairy tale. For idiots. Everyone knows that. Lord Forrester knew all about it. It's a fortress. Hidden from the world. And this says it's somewhere in the north. On the other side of the wall. And here I thought you might have some brains, Garrett. You two deserve each other. Have fun chasing your tails. Good. Didn't need him anyway. What do you mean? Finn doesn't know about the mammoths. Or white walkers. Or how to sneak past a giant. What, and you do? But you know, it's... The things you hear about. The rumours is all. I wouldn't know myself. How could I? Rumours my ass. You're hiding something, Cotter. I'm not. They're just things I hear around Castle Blacksall. People talk, you know. Not about the North Grove they don't. You do? Probably heard you talking about it. Or, or maybe one of the recruits. Don't make me regret lying about the knife for you, Cotter. Tell me what you know. All right. All right. I've been on the other side of the wall, Garrett. You see, I, I live there. In the north. I'm part of the free folk. People round here call wildlings. What? I know, I know, it's crazy. I, I was with some other free folk. We were looking for weapons, south of the wall. We got caught, so, so I passed myself off as a local and, well, well, they sentenced me here to Castle Black for stealing. I shouldn't be here. This isn't my place. I didn't know what else to do. Cotter. You're the bloody enemy. How am I supposed to trust you now? I'm not your enemy, Garrett. I'm your friend. Or at least I thought I was. Are we... Are we still friends? I mean... I know it's a lot to take in. Don't worry. Bloodthirsty wildling or not, we're still brothers. That is good to hear. <laughs> at least when Mance Raider wants to boil you alive, you'll know someone in high places. Cutter! What did I say? That shit house you fixed is still leaking! I'll be right there! Just shut us all. I'm going back home. No matter what, Garrett. I've heard stories. Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Your lord knew what he was talking about. You know where the North Grove is? No. But I'll help you find it. I'm deserting anyway. Heading back home. I can guide you. Keep you alive. 
Stick with me and I'll show you the way. Plenty of things out there want to kill you. I don't understand. Why would you want to help me? The North Grove has nothing to do with you. I've got my own reasons for going. Cut her! Now! Uh, on the way! Please, don't tell anyone about me. The watch would kill me if they found out. Boah, jetzt können wir ganz schön, äh, haben wir ganz schön was gegen ihn in der Hand. Crazy shit. Das liebe ich an dem Spiel so, dass es so um alle acht Ecken ist. Marine still smells like shit, even outside the walls. We'll find Croft here, somewhere. Yeah. <sighs> you right? <sighs> Never better. <laughs> Back under the Mad King, they used to say death by sword was a sweet kiss, but fire would fuck you hard. <laughs> Funny. No. No, not very. I'll go find Croft's tent. Asher, I need you to tell me the truth. I've come a long way to bring you home. Back in that cave, you made a choice. You must have thought only one of us was going to survive. Now, it's not a fair question to ask, but I need to know. I fought beside you, Uncle, too many times to count. I figured you could handle yourself. Beska was the one face to face with a dragon. Das ich ja I appreciate the respect, but it's not about that. Look, I can't blame you if your feelings about me are conflicted. Or your feelings about going home. Your family exiled you to this place. But I swore an oath to your mother. Sailed halfway around the world to bring you back safe. And I'll be damned if some dragon fire or your foul decisions are going to stop me. Are we clear? I'm here to help you. To protect you. I'm sorry, Malcolm. I did you wrong. Well, it's good of you to say so. But words are wind, Asher. It's choices that define who you are. Asher, I know where Croft is. Irgendwie versauen wir es bei allen. Merkt ihr das? It's Croft. <laughs> How well do you know him? Too well. I thought you said you were friends. Yeah, we are. We are. Great friends. Ich kenne nur Lara Croft. Asher fucking Forrester. Son of a poxy whore. You have some balls walking into my tent after all these years with that mama's monkey grin on your face. <laughs> well, that went well. Great friends indeed. You get it out your system? Not by half. You never understood consequences, Asher. One stupid mistake cost me an eye. But you never learn. You figured you'd steal from me and I'd just forgive you? <laughs> Not a fucking chance! So how are you going to pay me back? Your eye? Your hand? Or how about your tongue? Croft, no! Be reasonable! I am reasonable! I'm letting him fucking choose! Look, Croft. What we did was wrong. I'm sorry for that. You heard him. Now let him go. You're not getting out of this with a fucking apology. Croft. I deserve your anger as much as Asher. Don't worry, Beska. You're next. Now choose. Or I slice off your balls, Asher. Uh-oh. Hey, A hey, man hey! betrays my trust. There's a price Stop to this. Let him go! Enough! No more fucking about! Have it your way. You didn't need your testicles anyway. <laughs> Oh, that was bloody beautiful. Fucking Asher. You were pale as a oh. snow bear's ass. Oh. <laughs> are, you, are you fucking joking? You bloody bastard. <laughs> This is why people steal your shit and take off in the night. Come on, you assholes. Have a drink. Oh, was für ein Freak. Joden, the Khaleesi's best wine. Your friend has an interesting sense of humor. So what in seven hours are you two doing here on the arse end of the earth, eh? You're a long way from young guy. We have a proposition for you. We? 
You're hardly the usual rabble these two travel with. Your sword was always the quickest, Croft. I need you and your men to fight for me in Westeros. We need your hellhounds. A hundred good men. Am I in a hobby's tip? Would I ever <laughs> go back to Westeros? I've got it good right here. Her grace pays good coin. Yeah, here, gold aus der Höhle. I've got wine! Women! We can pay. I always knew your pockets were lines of gold. And I will happily take it from you. But it's not up to me. The second sons are sworn to Daenerys Targaryen. I've laid my sword at her feet. For now. Perhaps we could talk to her. She's a little busy right now, commanding a fucking siege. Her enemies are nailing children up on posts for a hundred miles. And a bloody dragon's gone missing. <laughs> But I know where to find her dragon. Ha! <laughs> Unfucking likely. You expect me to believe you've just happened to have seen the one fucking dragon loose in the world? Impossible. Black scales all over with a red frill running down his back. That doesn't prove anything. Enough of this nonsense. We're done here, Asher. Uncle, show him. Dragonfire did that. So you rolled over into the bloody campfire in your sleep. Croft, I've seen her dragon. <sighs> oh, bugger me with a bloody spear. <laughs> If you're lying about this, it'll cost more than your balls. Fair enough. Come on, you son of a bitch. The beast's name is Drogon. You'll want to hear about him right away. And don't think you're going to charm her with that fucking Asher grin. <laughs> ich feier den irgendwie. 